What up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. This is Foodie Zhang, and today we're gonna take you to a noodle place, a street that full of noodles. If you're looking for noodles, this is your best choice in Chengdu. And you know that noodles always been a rich culture in China. Today we're gonna go to this street to try them out. Look at the sign over there. It said Guang Mai Mian. It said we only sell noodles. Let's go check it out. You know that in China we said noodle is a beginning of the day, also could be an ending of the day. So that which pretty much explain that how important the noodle noodle culture in our life. smelled this one like 10 meters away and this smells so good we have to have this and it's that Chongqing Xiao Mian this is like a very specialty noodle from Chongqing and it's like number five in Chengdu let's go check it out oh my god this chili oil <laughs> smells damn good and also the garlic soy sauce onion cilantro so good. Jie bian shi mian, like you eat your noodles uh, right after you get it. It's also a culture in China, which we got ma la xiao mian, spicy and nummy noodle, which is so good. I like the lettuce in the noodles because it's really, I don't know, it's just give you more freshness. And look at the noodle, it's very thin and small, which is the feature of, because we got all kinds of noodles. One is like sh the sharp one, and also some like really thick, and some is like this thin. And it has peanuts in it, if you're allergic to peanuts, then tell them you don't want it. And also, it got onion, it got the peppercorn, which is gives you the nummy flavor. So this one is with broth, and we got also another one, it's one uh, mian. It doesn't have any broth in it, but this one, it has chili oil. The last step of eating this noodle is gonna drink your broth. But it's so good, which is nummy and refreshing. Okay, I'm gonna have the first taste. If you are coming for noodles, you better order a fried egg. And after you eat that, finish all the noodles, you dip the egg in your noodles, which makes the fried egg more juicy. One <laughs> zha it's also another famous noodle in Chuanyu Dichu. Oh my god, look at this piece. And this one, it doesn't have any broth. It's a little dry already, it's, which is dried. And now we're gonna add a little noodle soup to make it fluffy. Fluffy. Mian yi ling yao chen zao chi. Because there's a word that describes if you haven't finished your noodle in a long time, it's called tuo le. Your mian is going to tuo you know. The spirit of wan zha mian, wan zha noodle. It's the minced meat. Look at this, so good. It's like the noodle with peas, boiled peas, and the minced meat and lettuce with no soup, but it's also really good. It 
it's so aromatic, you know, like with the one bite, the piece of lettuce, the minced meat, and also peppercorn, chili oil. Well, there is no peanut in this one, but boiled peas, but in one bite, and also the sesame. <laughs> <laughs> the last step of finishing your noodle is have some noodle soup. It's like the water with flour taste in it. You can taste it's obviously noodle soup. Okay, I'm full. Now we're going to eat some other things. Go on, go on. We're gonna walk around at this noodle street and we're gonna go get some dessert which is called Liang Gao. Liang Gao is a very famous snack in Sichuan street food and it's actually from Yibing, Sichuan. It's a, another city in Sichuan and it's really famous. You will know what I'm talking about. Liang Gao is my favorite during the whole summertime because it's sticky and it's like cake but it's not and it's like they made it with rice and brown sugar and you have to like make it because it's like whole cake so you have to uh, you have to crush them into small pieces and make sure that every single bite you have it's sweet with the brown sugar okay I'm gonna have the first one and it's best to dessert after that strong flavored noodles. Every single noodle store right here smells so good, but it's like amazing. Some are like spicy or aromatic and some smells like a dish. And especially like the hui guo rou mian, it smells like hui guo rou because that's the soup base. And that's the very amazing right here in the noodle street. Okay guys. This is what we got for today. Make sure to like our video, subscribe our channel, and see you next time. By the way, appreciate my director, this little fan, for summertime. Bye bye.